The fall of 2019, there was a girl who came to Kingston. She was new to Canada, she knew no one, confused of where she sees herself and what will become of her future. Completely blank. And even more overwhelmed during the first day of MMI boot camp, where almost everyone seemed to know what they wanted to do or at least what industry they wanted to be affiliated with. But she didn't. So coming into MMI, my goal was to find a goal. I remember the first day we were asked this question to discuss among our teams. The question said that what is the one text that you would want to receive right now that will change your life. And to that I said I would like to receive a text that says what my passion is. So that is what MMI has given me, my passion. I realized it was my self-doubt that was not letting me embrace and wholeheartedly advocate my interest in fashion. But MMI taught me that not having a background or any experience in the industry wasn't a problem so although having the newly defined passion in the fashion industry wasn't enough through this one year journey i learned what what was needed to be done to be a part of this industry even though i had no experience in the past but now i'm working on two fashion startups um coming from a country miles away adapting to the culture was the biggest challenge for me So um I have always been dependent well, when it comes to house chores but together we made that learning fun as well <laughs> This novice left over from my brought up in Pakistan made it somehow difficult for me to adjust to this new life where I was supposed to do everything on my own cook on my own clean the house on my own moving houses and above everything bootstrap But in the end I fell in love with the lifestyle it gave me more control and charge over my own life Academically, um I have learned a lot from my teams. Initially, I wasn't able to put my best foot forward. I didn't feel much of use because of differences in culture and skills. But the teams really helped me understand these dynamics and learned soft skills like um leadership, the importance of taking initiative, and most importantly, if you want to get something done, start doing it yourself. People will appreciate any initiative. So it doesn't have to be perfect. You just have to start. So looking at my peers, I learned to pull my share of the load. I also didn't understand the importance of building a network initially or having coffee chats. It was really a novel concept for me. But I needed that the more to understand the dynamics of the fashion industry in order to be a part of it and eventually get leads in the field. And other than that, staying in touch with people is the biggest thing I've learned. The best part of MMI was that everyone would say yes to everything. We are so inclusive, embracing and so accepting of everyone and everything that it made learning even more fun. There were people celebrating little successes with me, motivating me when I was in a slump and just being there beyond the constraints of a classroom. We didn't just learn together, but celebrated every event together or took a trip together. I found a new family. Those who were not in Kingston stayed in touch through video calls. We didn't leave anyone behind. I I have really learned so much from my cohort. It was really encouraging to see people landing jobs in great companies like Loblaws, launching amazing projects and making a change. So I really found my why eventually. Now people think of me when they talk about fashion. They have started recognizing and associating me with the industry because I have started talking about it. and with that people direct so many opportunities towards me that are related to fashion so that's actually a huge transformation for the girl who landed in kingston with no plans at all i couldn't be happier with where i am right now from uncertainty to huge aspirations but it doesn't really end <laughs> there's a long long way to go as professor nusha says you have signed us up for life so mmi has really infused us with the notion that we are being groomed to reform the world and have an impact on the world i i belong in the fashion industry i'm close to securing a job in the marketing right now however i'll continue with the project rui that is my uh, work from home loungewear brand uh, that came up after lots of pivots active wear to at leisure to loungewear and to finally work from home loungewear so i have huge expectations and satisfaction with the value that i have received and finally we are close to graduation so i'm happy thank you mmi
Thank you, Professor Nusha. Thank you, Sherry, for all the support. And thank you, everyone who has been a part of MMI.